Hello guys, my name is Ixon Morph 96 back with another video. This video is a little bit different than I do normally do, um, but I'm going to give it on a very good high note. Um, I'm not sponsored by them, although I might say, you know, they do, I'll say this, but they do good quality things. I went unboxing to do, and yes, this box unboxing is um, different. It is by Oxford die Diecast. Everyone should know who Oxford Diecast is by now. Um, they do all the they do all the um, diecasts. Um, I thought I'd do one, and I thought, well, I saw this thing years ago with the one point seven six scale model, which is the one that I collect uh, for die casts, and I thought, you know, I'll do it. I'll open it up and see it. The box is actually on the side, um, literally on the side, and it's basically quite a, quite a nice little box. Um, obviously, you know what a box looks like because I'm not going to show you a box. Um, I've already opened the two sides and the top of it off. I don't know what's inside of it. I'm going to dig into it and we're, we're going to look, talk about, about, it, about it. So I'm going to open it up. <clears throat> and of course, the first thing you see is brown pepper. Quite a lot of brown pepper. So. They can not give me the stuff that I wanted. So it's a bus bundle. Obviously, I want to show you the receipt that I've got, which is, this is the receipt. It tells you what I've got and how much it costs and everything, blah, blah, blah. But yeah. So, they're all 1.76. There's not many buses in here today, which I'm surprised. There should be quite a lot, uh, but they're in. Uh, but yeah, we'll have a little look, we'll have a little gander. First bus uh, I'm going to look at is this bus straight away off the top. This is a 1.766 scale model uh, bus, which is a Ford 400E van, South Down, Southern South Down. Good quite a little bus. Obviously, I don't, I don't. By the way, I look, I will let, no, I don't not get them out of the packaging because it's just a mess. Nice little bus. Um, little camper van. Um, oh, good to have a collection of, of these. Um, and it's always a nice little uh, van to have because uh, I believe you don't see many of these vans now. <coughs> Old history. So, we're going to move on. And I've just seen this, I, by the way, I've just seen this van. Um, and I believe this is a, is this the right one? Yes. This is, you're probably thinking, well, that's a London bus, like Xenomorph. Yes, it is. Well done. This is a London bus. Um, unfortunately, the destination on it says it's going to go to Piccadilly Circus, but also it's going from Liverpool Street. <clears throat> so it's a nice little London bus. Um, I've got a couple of these London buses. And they're really good. That um, some of them, what I normally do is I take the bottom off them and then repaint the entire thing, which is a good little bus to have. I'm hoping in this, I will let you know now what I'm trying to hope for. I'm hoping to get a a what do we call it now? A couple of at least a couple of um, Alexander Dennis's in this. I know there's not many buses, which is a bit a shame. I thought it would be stock, stacked with the buses, but fortunately it isn't. Um, but yeah, I'm hoping to get some Alexander's, Alexander Dennis's uh, double-deckers in this and some Optair Solos, which I do definitely need because they're really good little buses, um, Optair Solos, and the Alexander Dennis's, obviously Alexander Dennis, comes from <clears throat> the Scotland area, uh, funny enough. But yeah, we're going to press on, and yes, I've got one that's a little bit damaged, 
it was just a package that's damaged. Yes, we've got another London bus, uh, which is a Routemaster London. Just going to show you. I know the packaging. In fact, I'm going, take, I'm going to take the packaging off so it looks a bit better. That's what it looks like. I know it's going to, it's going to do a reflection in it. That's what it looks like. I'm going to pull it away from the the light. That's what it looks like. Quite a nice little bus that is. Um, basically another little London bus basically. Um, but that is a nice little route master that. Put it to one side. There's not many buses here and I can tell you this reason why. Another reason why. Uh, well, I'm hoping to get the Xander but I'm hoping I do get it off. Um, the next bus is a Beedle Integrate. If I said that correctly, I do apologise if I haven't. That's the bus. If you don't know what it is, I'm just going to try and show it off with, without the light. Same again, it's that. I do like, I like its front and back end. An old school bus. I'm, I'm, I'm a bit of a sucker for old school stuff, but... Anyway, it's a lovely little bus. Um, that got, it's a bit, basically, it's a Selby bus, which is a quite a nice little bus to have. In the collection. <clears throat> Let's get another bus out now. Oh god! I'm not really. I'm, I will let you know now, guys. I'm not a, an expert on buses. I'm not an expert. The person who's an expert on buses is someone who I do truly know, and he doesn't like the back of his hand. He's got. Let's put it this way: he's got the books about them. So there, there's 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 your clue. Um. I know this bus goes to Cardiff, but that's the bus there. I'm just going to show you up close. I don't know if you can see the, the wording up here. But it's a, a, a Wayman Fair, a Fun Finder, A-E-C, a North and Cardiff. So it's a, this is a, oh, I'm going to say it's a Cardiff bus, basically. It's a Cardiff bus. I love, I do love the front end, the front end of it. It's um unusual. And it goes back to a, to its different sort of thing. I'm just dying for a fucking Alexander. That's all I'm looking for. Uh, next box is, is a, a Paxton Paramount Rib Ribble. Which obviously, if, if you know where they go, they go to Blackpool. And that's the bus there. It's a lovely little bus that is. Um, I do like, obviously, well, obviously you, you've probably seen seen it from that position, that position, and that position. Obviously, the front end is obviously it's an old school design, which I do love. It's got actually the vents, it's got the wind, you know, the uh, the windows at the top, you know, for for the sunlight. Remember, the, these buses back in the day would have been would have been standard. Um, but that's a nice little bus. I do like that. It's more of a, it is, it does look like a coach, but it's a bus to do it. So that's going to be a quick And then, I'm just going to just, just checking for any more. And then we've got a, a Dupal Commander 2, uh, Greenside. Obviously, this is the last bus, I'm afraid, uh, I've got in this fleet, in this uh, thing. Yeah, this is the this is the obviously the last um this one this is the last one in it. It's a shame that I didn't get the Alexanders or the upside solos, which would be brilliant to have them. Um, yeah, this bus, I believe you. I just need to show it again to you. Just trying to get it off the camera lens. Yep, that's the bus there. Um, another old school bus. This one goes to Plymouth. Fair enough. A really nice little bus. Um, love it. Love it. I love it. Love it. So in total, uh, in this one point seven six bus bundle, which you only get what one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven buses. So you get seven buses for fifty quid. Is it a good deal? To be honest with you, if you're getting only seven buses. I think the price should be a little bit cheaper, um, to be honest with you. Um, but 
with the quality of buses, I can understand why it's at that price. Um, but yeah, um, am I happy with my with my order? Yes, I am. Um, really happy actually. I'm happy um, so much that you don't realise. Um, but yeah. The buses are a good quality and everything. Um, I'm just hoping Oxford Diecast gets to see this video actually because this is my honest opinion about them because they, these are old school. Some are a lot of them, well, all of them are old school buses which I do do care to love. And uh, you know, unlike some of them might actually get transformed into something what I'm doing. I'm not sure yet at the moment. Um, I'll have to find out there. But yeah, these are quite good buses. Um, I might ask um, if I can ask them nicely. Oxford Diecast to team up with me so I can get a free. But I, th I, th I think it's a free. You do something with them and you, you get something nice from them anyway. I've seen people do it, you know on their own chip channels to get something nice, you know, like a gift or something from might actually review some more of these buses because there are really nice to have. Um like I said there is there's not many buses and I was expecting the entire whole box to be filled, basically. Filled to the brim. Um but it isn't, fortunately. Um but yeah. I'm happy with what I've got. Uh, like I said, it should have been a little bit cheaper if you're only getting what seven buses roughly. I understand with the quality uh, of the buses that what they are. Um, but yeah, um, am I disappointed that I didn't get what I, what I was expecting? Yeah, I was expecting to get um, some Octa Solos. Or some Alexander Dennis's, like I said, because um, I actually do not have them in my collection at all. Um, I think I think Corgi do them. I believe Corgi does them. I'm not quite sure. You know, comment on it obviously. Comment on the below if you if you know where where you can get them from, because then I might be able to dig them around somewhere. But they, yeah, these are definitely going in my collection um, for sure. Basically for sure. It's, like I said, it's just, it's, it was a nice little thing that I've got, and obviously these buses are nice, and, you know, they're all 1.76, there is no lie to it, and if you want to know why the 1.6, uh, how you, how I knew the 1.6, just says it there, I don't know if I can zoom into the camera, I'm trying to get it right, I'm trying to get it right, this little green label here, it says 1.76, that's how I knew, but I collect 1.76s no matter what. Um, they're not, they are kind of rare to find, but these are coming, these are the best ones to collect for me, personally. Um, it's just because it's easy to collect them. Um, but yeah, I might, I might go and do, uh, might ask, Obviously, I've, I know I've got Oxford Diecast's number, I've got Cargill's number as well. I might ask him if I could get, you know, do do some more bundles with them, you know. But, yeah, I want to see what they've got and see what I can get out of it. Um, but, yeah, I am going to, I am trying to track down the Alexander Dennis's and Dr. Solos. There's certain ones I need, certain ones I want. Um, that's the reason why uh, there's no point just getting any of them and just doing thing like this it's pointless but yeah um i'm happy what i've got and i'm really really happy because it's i didn't expect i was gonna get them but i'm i can surely say yes it, it may be 50 quid to buy all this and you only get seven i know if you get the non bundle it's 50 quid but you get a mixture of all and i mean from low to high um but yeah, that, that that's that's quite cool. Um, but yeah, I'm happy with what I got here. Um, I, 
I'm not saying, oh, well, I, I, I'm making a grump about it, but I'm not. Um, we've got three, four, five, six, yeah, so seven buses for 50 quid. Yes, the quality is good, and I will say that the quality is good. And literally every single one of them is an old school watch. I think they don't use these, no, these buses no more, so they use the new school stuff. Uh, what we're getting, but yeah, I am very happy about what I've got here. Um, today basically and, and and it's a a nice little feeling to know that I got some nice buses but yeah I'm willing to do more of these bundles um, and do it honestly give it to you guys to show them what, what I've got uh, I collect 1.76 so it, it's a lot better for me to collect them that type because I can then use what I need to use from um, I might do a couple of Corgi ones, um, see how much they are, because I know the prices at what what's going on uh, over here. Obviously, if you're abroad, you probably, probably might not know, but we're in like a cost of living effect, where everything is just rocketed. Um, it's like we can't even, can't even afford a buddy tin of soup, never mind a buddy a pack of beans. But um, <coughs> anyway, on that note, I'm happy with all the quality of the buses. I'm, I'm really, really, really. I, I didn't expect I was going to get these. I really didn't. Um, do look the quality. I might actually ask Corgi if I, uh, Oxford or Dice Corgi, where, where I got these. And uh, I will say a special thank you right now <clears throat> to Oxford uh, for, you know, ha having the time to do this. You know, give the, you no, know, obviously, filling my order and pu putting them out for me. Uh, getting them out for me. Um, but I was expecting the box to be full. I hope that's how that's how that's how I look at it. Um, but yeah, um, I was hoping that box was going to be a chocker. You know, we've got got a lot for just fifty quid. Uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm kind of happy what I've got. I'm going to try and look at Corgi, see if I can do Corgi for you guys. Um, Corgi is another diecast, uh, which if you can't find anything on Oxford, I'm sure Corgi can do that as well. Um, so I'm going to try and see if I can do a bundle deal, deal there, see if they've got any bundle deals that I can, that I can have cool to look at. Um, but yeah, if you like this video, give us a like. I, li I liked this video, I'm, I'll, I'll break down everything I'm going to say now. A like to this video means this channel is going somewhere, and it means you like this video and you're, and you're into this type of stuff, which means you like to listen, you like to understand new things. Uh, give us a share, a share, you know, share this with your friends, your family members, you know, so it gets out there, um, and, you know, and everyone gets to see this video, some people might not be able to see this video, but yeah, by seeing this video, seeing this video, <clears throat> you are learning a little bit, you know, people might not know people who do diecasts. I'm one of them, unfortunately. I do do that cast, but yeah. Um, and the last part, I'm always going to say this, but I'm going to say it now, is subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. Um, it means a lot to me personally, because I know then, as a human being as I am, I know that you like this video. I know you shit. I I, I know that you want to see more of what I do and this channel grows um, more and more every day from every day to every week to every month I know I don't do as many videos as I do normally do but it grows and it means a lot um, but yeah um, I'm gonna try and do some more uh, of these videos of these videos as best I can and I'm going to say you know when when I, when I do these videos I feel great about myself doing these videos because it shows you guys that I'm passionate um, obviously I know I've done, I've done some videos where I've had to repaint uh, some buses um, which was a pain in the ass which was a pain I will tell you that it was a pain um, be painting a bus is just not the thing you want to do um but yeah um 
until the next video guys i'm gonna say this please stay safe you know i know it's cold or it might be warming to, uh, in, across the bro about uh, uh, across the borders or um, abroad but because i say safe uh, and i will catch you in the next video peace out